Hi, Mark Camosio, Gunmark TV. And I just want to show you here um, some really good little targets. Uh, this is a company, Custom Targets, um, based down in Somerset, I believe. And they've made quite a name for themselves with um, some dedicated targets for the shooter. Um, this lot primarily for air gun use, but obviously I'm sure it could be adapted. But there's a whole series of packs of um, different sites of target. They did a lot of experimentation apparently um, with different mediums to, to make their targets out of and uh, they sort of arrived at this hardboard and I must, must say having shot it now, it, it's the perfect medium because it doesn't splinter and it, things, you know, the kill areas react um, perfectly so they sort of quickly um, snap off etc. But if you look at this, um, you can see you've got a whole, you know, many, many kill zones, um, reactive kill zones on the target. So if you get your pellet through there, you can knock out the center and try and do it without hitting the edge, etc. Um, and you've got a whole load of, of, of kill zones on there. And then you've got other ones, sort of like a traditional sort of fairground bottle arrangement. And they've done some quite quirky ones with the coronavirus, the dreaded coronavirus. <laughs> um, you've got that there. And then this is one I actually shot. You can see you've shot away. The little areas drop away and you've got all different size kills. Um, so it's, it's a real challenge. I came out with one called Dead Eye and this is firm and obviously I'm obsessed with HFT. And you set that up at sort of 25 yards and try and get your pellet. You can get it through the hole without touching the side. You, it's one hell of a shot. Likewise there, you can actually go through the centers without destroying it or choose to take out the rim. Um, it's, it's great. It's really, um, it's as demanding as you want it, basically. Obviously, they've got all different targets. There are bigger kill areas. Uh, this is just an example. You know, if you take a look at their website and you'll see a whole load more. The beauty of these, if you look at all these targets, there's a central circle <coughs> and you can buy as an optional extra a little stand simple wing nut take that off put it through put the, any of these targets we've got a central hole so you just put that on do your wing nut up like that it's all rather clever actually very simple but they're really effective you've got god loads of loads of different shots on there now that's a simple spike into the ground and you've got um, a target there obviously you'd have to worry about your backstop that you would anywhere but if you're doing this on a big field or at a shooting club, um, you know, you haven't got to worry about that. Um, if you're going to do it in your garden, make sure you've got a nice metal screen behind. But um, they're, they're very, very effective. Now there's another target that I've only just come to uh, hear about, and that is their pin target system. Replaceable because you can um, actually, you buy spare targets and you can just slot them in place and other ones hang from the system. We'll, we'll be showing you all this outdoors, um, but you, for another tenner, you can get the, obviously that this comes with two legs, which are effectively spikes that will just push into the ground on a, on a field. Um, but if you don't want that, and you want it freestanding on a hard standing, you've got two legs as well. And then I'd say it's 10 quid for that base. So that's really good. This currently um, is being offered. It did come with 500 targets, 500 little targets that all slot in. They're currently offering with a free, um, bag of another 500 so you've got a thousand targets and again they're replaceable you can always buy extras and it's a whole hanging system but we'll show you that outside but it's um, it's very impressive so this is custom targets And now Mark's going to try for one of the hanging ones. These are harder to hit because they swing back as they're struck. But it's still pretty impressive. As you can see, these represent a very challenging target because those little tiny laser cut center bits are very small to hit and uh, really good practice for air gunners and also make a great little competition amongst 
uh, club members as well. I think it's a really great bit of kit. So there you can see the, um, the target in action there. Um, we had a bit, bit of fun shooting that. Obviously these ones at the top, it's all quick pegs that just completely slot in. It's a really good little system there. Um, obviously it was much easier shooting these ones at the top because they're static. Tiniest bit of wind and these start to move and that really makes, uh, you know, puts the cat amongst the pigeons as they say. But yeah, I, I love this system. It's, um, uh, you know, it may, may seem a bit of an outlay at the start, but it's, um, it's all really solidly made. You get your, your, your stake there and then everything else, as I say, just pegs into each slot. At the moment, um, as I say, you're getting a thousand targets, um, you know, different sizes just to drop in and you get this little clip system. It's um, great fun. So that's the replaceable pin target system. Um, as I say, with these, it's pretty tricky stuff, you know, outdoors with the tiniest bit of wind. But obviously it's um, sort of bench rest, 25 yards, you've got one hell of a challenge there and you pick your kill areas and you can try and be as clean as you want with your shots. So yeah, great fun. 